We have team coverage tonight. Natalie Brennan and Jacqueline Quinn are standing by. But first, let's head over to CBS News Miami's Ted Scouten with more on the Israeli family reunions happening right here in South Florida. Ted. Yeah, tonight a lot of families here in South Florida are welcoming loved ones home from Israel. A flight just landed here in Miami about an hour ago or so, and tonight we're hearing their stories. But my daughter went for the holiday. Um, oh, she's here. As I'm speaking to Hami Jacobson at the airport, she spots her 15-year-old daughter home safe and sound. It's the long embrace that both of them have been waiting for since Saturday. What was it like to see your mom just now? Best thing in the world. <laughs> Esther shared frightening video from her trip. And it was pretty scary, but we're okay. Esther recalls having to race to the bomb shelter several times. She's grateful she's okay. But it was definitely like an experience I've never felt before and something very new and, and strange to me, but, but thank God we're, we're all okay, we're all good. She was relieved to be on a flight home to South Florida. Her mom, grateful too, but thinks of family still in Israel. I just need to have my children with me. I just, and I just keep thinking about my cousins who, and my sisters who don't, you know, their kids serve. They, they can't grab their kid and hold them. And, and we're very proud of them and we're very grateful. My cousins were protecting the highways that she was able to get to the airport safely and come home to me. Esther has a special message for those who kept her safe. Thank you so much to every single soldier who's putting their life on the line to protect me and get me home. Thank you. Obviously, a lot of very grateful families here in South Florida tonight as they welcome their loved ones home and they continue to think about their other loved ones, family and friends who are still there in Israel. Now, coming up at 6 o'clock tonight, not only are people coming back to South Florida to come home, but others are going home to Israel. We'll talk to them at 6. Live at Miami International, Ted Scout, CBS News Miami. Ted, thank you very much.